only on six tonight. We're hearing from the friends of the man who drowned in the Miami River last weekend. The 23 year old visiting from Mississippi was a trucker, but was planning to join the police academy after that vacation. Jamie Garola is live in Miami tonight with this exclusive Jamie. Yeah, one of the victim's friends says he was hesitant to make the trip to Miami. Now she says she wishes he never did. I'm in disbelief. I wanted this to be like a prank. I wanted this to be a prank. Like it's unbelievable that you can be here one day and gone the next. Days after a 23 year old drowned in the Miami River, his friends are still trying to understand the tragedy. That's my best friend. Like it's hard to take that in. Like somebody you planned your whole life with, somebody you know since you was little. Somebody talk to every day. On Sunday, around 3.30 in the afternoon, the FWC says Trevante Johnson, or Vaughn, as his friends called him, fell into the water near the mouth of the Miami River from a chartered boat. Several people tried to rescue him, but couldn't. He was unresponsive when divers found him at the bottom of the river. I really couldn't believe it. I just really wish that somebody could have saved him. If I was there, I would have put on the life jacket and I would have jumped in. Because like I just I just I just hate that he had to go that way. Chad McPherson said she spoke to Vaughn moments before he fell into the water. When I had just FaceTimed him prior to the accident, he was just having fun, you know. He was on FaceTime, and I told him when he got off the boat to so just you know call me when he got done. And I never got that call back. Vaughn was a trucker on vacation from Mississippi, but he would never make it back home where his friends say he wanted to join the police academy. Vaughn's friends said he liked fashion and to dress up, which may be why police first identified Vaughn as a woman. I miss everything about him. Everything, his smile, he, the light of the room, always there for you, would give you the shirt off his back. I love him and I miss him. I'm gonna miss him. He was a really good person. Now, visitation and funeral services are next week in Mississippi. Reporting live tonight in Miami, Jamie Garola, NBC6 News. Jamie, thank you.